gamers and Martuari and welcome back to another episode of Conan Exiles and I think today we will be doing some exploring hopefully get uh, some more thralls to tame out and yeah see what we can find in the world of Conan Exiles so let's jump straight in back at base so first things first make sure you have water make sure you have plenty of water if you go out on uh, travels or adventures you, you need water anyway so fill fill the water bar fill your water skin and then head out for some exploration. Okay, time for an update. I'm right here on the map. And yeah, this little thing here, it seems to be an entrance to a cave. A cave with NPCs, which uh, seems to be pretty hard to get in. Because there are uh, quite a few archers guarding the entrance. You see, all archers. And yeah, it's tough to get closer. I'm gonna try. I have some Ambrosia with me, so that's good. I can try some regeneration. This is a fighter. I should be able to kill that one. Oh, I didn't bring a lot of Ambrosia with me, actually. Kill this one too. Okay, I got him. I got him. Now the question is, if I get in, uh, I will probably get <sighs> corruption again. Actually, hmm. I'm going to be using the torch. I'm not sure, but I, I think I will be getting corruption pretty soon. I don't see a thing in here. What's this rock? Ooh, brimstone. Awesome. Oh, if I remember this correctly, I need that in order to make steel at some point. Oh, that's great. That's great. I'm going to be gathering some brimstone. And yeah, hope that it's not all too dangerous up here. Oh, look at that, man. Oh, this looks cool, man. Well, at least I ha I'm getting brimstone. <laughs> That's a good thing. I should be bringing that back to my base pretty soon because uh, I'm going to be overburdened. I gained a level. I want to peek inside. Oh, oh, oh. Warrior. A fighter. Come on, I'm hitting you. Die. Uh, guess who died here? Oh, a note. Hunter's note. Imps. Oh, no, no, no. I need that too. Take all. Yeah, I'm gonna have to venture back. But look at this, man. This cave looks amazing. Another arch down there. Oh yeah, I have to get out. I'm gonna have to. I need to bring the brimstone back to my base because otherwise I might die again. Okay, we don't lose anything when we die, but uh, still. I didn't make this trip to lose everything I have. I'm uh, checking if maybe there is a quick way down if I head up here and maybe I can jump down the rocks. Ooh, it's pretty dark. Night is falling. Better not move all that much then, because there is really nothing I, I can see. I can't even see if it's safe to jump down, so... Uh, this might work. Well, it might not. Oh, yeah. Look, that's <laughs> strange. No fall damage. Yet, if I would have fallen... Well, if you had seen me early, I fell a little bit and, uh, yeah, got killed. It wasn't even worth mentioning that I was falling. Come on, stay here. stupid thing is fast. I wouldn't be running that fast if I was hurt. Uh. I'm actually not quite sure how I should be uh, getting the steel. 
I will have to experiment with that. Check a few things. I thought you need uh, tar and brimstone. Not sure. We can check. Uh, if I put the brimstone in here and I put in some tar, what would happen? So the brimstone is in. I have tar. Plenty of tar normally in here. Tar you get from... Uh, from the tannery, so that's uh, that's also nice. No, that doesn't give me a, a thing. Okay, I think I found something. Uh, steel is actually a pretty uh, difficult process to make. Well, not difficult, but in, it involves quite a few steps. I was right, you need brimstone and you need tar. But you don't have to put those into, uh, into uh, the uh, furnace. So that's not a thing. I'm gonna have to do something else with them. Uh, put this away quickly. So I can move again. I'm not sure if it works in this. But I think I need the cauldron. Mm, let's check. If I put this in. Oh, this in and this in and turn on the light. What will we get? Uh, turn on the fire. No. Just gruel and uh, the other thing. So that's not it. Okay, I need to eat and drink probably. Yeah. Food is a thing in Ark. Uh, in Ark. In Conan. There. Uh, that's done. Uh, I need, I think, the cauldron. I thought I already built one. I, I am quite sure I learned it. Uh, where is it? This one. I think that's what I need. I need iron reinforcements and twine. Oh, darn, I don't have any iron reinforcements anymore, I think. Mm, maybe I have some in there. Let's check how many I need. I need 50 iron reinforcements and 25 twine. I have six iron reinforcements, not enough. And I have twine, I have enough. But I do need more iron reinforcements. Can I make another 50, maybe? Uh, iron reinforcements. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. This will take a while because, as you can see, this is very, very slow. No. Uh, let me check. This one is a Nordheim. This one is a another one. Yeah, it's as slow. It isn't really fast. I was kind of wishing of, or kind of hoping that you could put tooth rolls in here to speed the process up even further. But apparently you can't, so I will have to wait until those are uh, created. And then I can check it out how to make uh, whatever I need. Meanwhile, things are fighting outside, so yeah, that's cool too. Oh, hold on a sec. Okay, I think it's uh, time for an update. I decided to build a second blacksmith's bench because... Yeah, building these things was way too slow. It's even slow now with, with two of them. But at least I can now uh, make them twice as fast since I have two of those blacksmiths. And I have enough to make myself the cauldron. Yes. Uh, I'm not quite sure where I will be able to put that since... Yeah, I, I would kind of think like the, that the cauldron needs to be hanged on something. So I have no idea how this will work. We will see. Uh, okay, it's almost done. Let's put it on the hotbar number six. Yeah, you see, I think it, it... Oh, no, it's just placing on the floor. Okay, that's cool. Uh, where will I place it? Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, probably somewhere up here is, is good enough. There we go. So, what does it need? Oh, look. It can do something with, uh, with the aloe vera. Huh. Well, let's put the, the brimstone in, since that's the first thing we will be uh, trying out. Uh, it needs wood. I can go get some wood. I have uh, some tar in here. I thought I had taken some tar. Maybe I did put it in here. Nope, no tar in here. Oh yeah, I'm gonna pick uh, one set of tar from here. 
Uh, do I have some more wood? Yes, I have wood in here. Just to make sure that it works, because I have no idea. So, put that in here. Tar and brimstone. Get some wood going. Turn it on. And it will create steel fire. Yes. And you need steel fire. Uh, you need to combine steel fire with iron to make uh, steel. So, that's going to be next. I'm going to be putting some more ingredients in here to check what it makes. Uh, we will see. Maybe maybe it can boil eggs. Who knows? But I had seen something with aloe vera. I have some aloe vera. I have some rotten meat. I have some of this, some of this. Who knows? Maybe it will make some potions as I kind of think it does. Uh, this doesn't do a thing. This. What does it make? An alloy extract. Oh. Nothing with that. Nothing with that. Okay. Well, I guess we will have to wait until the steel fire is done. And then we can check that out as well. Okay, I have some uh, steel fire here. And you need to combine that with the iron ore in the furnace to get... Um, steel. So yeah, let's try that. Turn this on. There we go. Yes, it is making steel. Awesome. We're now at the steel level. So we will be able to make steel stuff. What steel stuff can I make? Steel hatchets, steel picks, and later on steel, uh, steel weapons, steel armor, steel building blocks probably. So yeah, we, we've advanced a little bit. Uh, this thing is also making aloe extract. I'm going to check that really quick. What is it? Info. Stygian traditions of healing hold that the aloe plant contains many desirable properties. In Luxor, the aloe is harvested for use in the temples of uh, the Heito to cleanse blemishes from the skin of the priestesses. It is often used to soothe, to soothe oozing wounds and those who ingest it claim that they feel a burst of well-being. Whether these effects are of the body or the mind is irrelevant. Ingesting aloe extract seems to give the imbue in imbiber a regenerative health effect. So, it's probably a little bit like, uh, like the ambrosia then. Mm, we will have to play with it. We will have to play with it. Uh, I have more of the, this stuff. Plenty more of this stuff. Uh, this doesn't do a thing. I can get all that out. It doesn't uh, do a thing anyway. And I can fill it with brimstone. Maybe get some more uh, steel fire going. Um, should be making... Uh, I will be making another cauldron. So I need 50 more of those. Uh, he's making 17 here. This guy is making 22, which is 39, which means I need another 11. Uh, I need more st iron. There. Ten, eleven. Okay. This also means I will have to go uh, back up again. Get some more uh, iron, iron ore. To create some iron bars and later on you will be able to make uh, yeah more steel out of it but anyway i think uh, i think this will be it for today actually we've been doing a few things we've been getting upgrades we've been getting our uh, some more uh, thralls which are taming out and uh, yeah we also got uh, this cauldron and we discovered brimstone in the little cave we made some uh, steel fire from it and we combined the steel fire with the iron uh, to get some steel. So next time maybe we can make some armor and venture out a little bit uh, further into the lands of Conan Barbarian, 
or Conan Exiles. Hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, feel free to hit the thumbs up button. And if you have comments or suggestions, feel free to post those in the comment section below the video. Check the description. That's where you'll find links to my Patreon page, links to my social media websites, and links to the crazy folks and the creative misfits. And you can also subscribe to the channel. Not only do you help me reach my next subscriber goal, but you will also get notified when I post new content to the channel. That being said, it's time to wrap up today's episode. Until next time, have fun and stay safe. Bye.